Hi, I'm Dr. Eric Ball Cavage, and if you're at this page of the website, then you may be struggling with peripheral neuropathy. If you have numbness, tingling in your feet or hands, your extremities are cold all the time, you have decreased circulation, uh, especially in the feet if you have increased nail fungus, these are indications that you may be suffering with peripheral neuropathy. If the condition has gotten worse, you may have that chronic sensation that you have like a sock rolled up under your foot, or you've progressed to a point where you have gnawing, burning pain that really becomes uncomfortable. And that's usually what le leads people to start trying prescription medications to help manage the pain. You may have already been diagnosed with peripheral neuropathy, or maybe you just have the symptoms and think you have neuropathy and nobody's told you that yet. But if you have neuropathy or you have the symptoms of neuropathy and you're looking to find out if that's what you have, then you can call the office. We help people recover from neuropathy all the time. Are you losing your balance? This is one of the biggest concerns I have for my patients that come to see me with neuropathy conditions or neuropathy symptoms is, is that at some point there's enough nerve damage done that the person no longer uh, can maintain balance really well. We see that they have to always look down. Their, their, their gait's a bit more shuffled. Uh, they're, they're they lose their balance a lot. And for the 50 plus group, I'm really concerned about that because for that age group, the number one cause of death is falls and, and, and the injuries as a result of falls. So one of the reasons that these people fall, and maybe you, is that you can't feel your feet. So you get up quickly, you're on a blood pressure medication, blood pressure doesn't medi regulate quite quickly enough. The combination of reduced blood flow to brain and can't feel your feet is a recipe for disaster. It's a recipe, recipe for a fall and injury. A lot of times I see people come into my office who have uh, neuropathy symptoms or are being treated for peripheral neuropathy is they've lost their quality of life. And that's a shame when it gets that far. Maybe they were avid walkers or golfers or uh, did things athletically or just did a lot more work around the house. And now because of the pain, the numbness, the tingling and the loss of balance, they're just, they've lost their quality of life. They don't go out as often. They're not as active as they used to be. And so one of the things I really want to help people do is get that quality of life back. And our program that I've developed has been super successful in taking people with pretty significant and severe neuropathy and not just remove their or improve their symptoms, but actually for some people got 100% remission of their symptoms and they've gotten their balance and they've gotten their quality of life back. You may be already taking medications and you took the medications, but now they're no longer working. What you've probably found is that, th is that the medications for neuropathy may temporarily block some of the symptoms, but the longer you take them, the less effective they are. And then you have to take a couple different medications to try and block out the pain perception. Ne medications that are given for peripheral neuropathy never ever address or fix the neuropathy condition. All they're designed to do is block your perception of pain in the brain. That's what they're designed to do. You take those medications, nobody addresses the underlying cause of why you have neuropathy in the first place, and your condition continues to deteriorate, which is why the medications start to fail over time and why your, your condition and your symptoms get worse. So the other thing is, is that what most people don't realize is some of the most common medications that they've been taking for years, things like reflux medications, blood pressure medications, uh, gout medications, and cholesterol medications, these types of medications are the things that actually cause peripheral neuropathy. Many of the medications that maybe you've been taking for 5, 10, 15, 20 years, the long-term side effect of those medications is to create damage to the peripheral nerves. Either a deep, they decrease blood flow to the peripheral nerves, or they cre create actual damage to the nerves or trigger inflammation or vitamin deficiencies. But one way or another, those, those top condition drugs are the underlying cause of most people's neuropathy. And lastly, many people, when they're diagnosed with neuropathy, they go to their doctor with these symptoms, the doctors give them the prescription and tell them, listen, there's nothing that can be done to reverse the neuropathy. It's, it's just going to be a progressive degenerative condition and the only solution is medication. And that's just not true. We know through science and research that nerves can heal and regenerate but you have to remove the causative factor, 
uh, to get the nerves to heal and regenerate. And most doctors just aren't doing that. Only thing they're doing is prescribing medications to mask symptoms. And we know that if it works, it's only going to work for a short period of time to block the sensation, but the, condi the condition is gonna to continue to deteriorate. So if you're struggling with numbness, tingling, cold extremities, burning pain, loss of balance, and you wanna find out if there's something that can be done to help you not just remove your neuropathy symptoms or reduce your neuropathy symptoms, but actually heal the nerves to get your quality of life back, to get your balance back, then pick up the phone and call the office. My staff will help you schedule an appointment or we'll do a peripheral neuropathy exam to evaluate if that's what you have, and then I can help you understand what needs to be done to help you recover from your peripheral neuropathy and get your quality of life back, okay? I look forward to seeing you in the office. Take care.